So Spotify removed Neil Young's music. And there's now a boycott Spotify movement. But Spotify is a private company. It can host or remove who it wants. Neil Young's music is half owned by UK investment firm Hypnosis Songs. They churn over $138.4 million in revenue a year. The firm presumably had some involvement in the decision to force Spotify to remove Young's catalogue. A major stakeholder in Hypnosis Song Management is the Blackstone Group. And who, a few months before the vaccine rollout, was appointed senior advisor to the Blackstone Group? Jeffrey B. Kindler, former chairman and CEO of Pfizer. The CEO of Blackstone is Stephen A. Schwartzman. Schwartzman is a regular attendee at the World Economic Forum, the Dr. Strangelove-led globalist group that has called for a world regulation system to censor, quote, misinformation about vaccines. But all that's just a coincidence, I'm sure. Meanwhile, comedian Adam Carolla pointed out the glaring contradiction of Neil Young, sticking it to the man in some of his most popular songs, now seemingly having become a mouthpiece for the man. I find it interesting coming from rockers and comedians and artists, because their job is to push back against the man and Neil Young should know the man isn't Joe Rogan. The man is Dr. Fauci. The man is Governor Gavin Newsom. The man is the CDC. The man is the WHO. The man is Biden. That's who the man is. You're an old rocker. You're supposed to push back against the man. Joe Rogan is pushing back against the man, and you're pushing back against Joe Rogan. But is there still another way out of this mess? To show their obedience and conformity for the greater good, perhaps instead of his music being removed entirely, those who want to listen to Neil Young on Spotify can just scan their vaccine passport via a QR code. This could then be extended to numerous other major artists. There's even rumours of a new super band. Rage Against the Machine teaming up with Neil Young for a residency at the Capital One Arena. Sponsored by Pfizer. The gig is called Rage on behalf of the regime. Get your tickets now and hear all the classics. Keep on inoculating in the COVID camp. Shilling in the name of quadruple vaxxed only. Five layered face masks mandatory. To get exclusive content, early access, behind the scenes stuff, and to personally interact with me, please sign up for my community at pauljosephwatson.locals.com. Link in description and thank you for your generous support.